And tonight we are learning more about a water rescue. A Columbus boy was pulled from a freezing pond after he fell through the ice. The officers who responded used ropes from their cruisers to try to pull that child to safety. Every officer carries these ropes. NBC 4's Dan Perlman is live tonight with an update. Dan? Yeah, well, you know, Officer Randall Lyons' thoughts were to go into the water right over here and save that boy. But then the ice broke and Lyons fell into the water as well. Now he is alive, likely thanks to a very critical piece of equipment. You'll find one. They are very important to have in every Columbus police cruiser. That's another tool in our toolbox. The bright orange bags stuffed with rope are called throw bags. Officers Cooper and Armentrout demonstrating on dry land. Ideally, they say they'd throw the bag to someone struggling in water, but take times like yesterday. The victim, unresponsive. We can put it on ourselves and go in and, and rescue the victim. That's when officers like Lyons yesterday attach the rope to something stable. We would like to attach it to a cruiser or a tree. Then tie it on themselves and with a partner holding on from dry land, make their way into the water. As we know, the ice beneath Lyons broke. Another officer and bystander forced to pull him to safety. Do you believe that this saved Officer Lyons' life? I, I do believe it did. It's a tool now with every officer for five years and counting. Perhaps part of why Officer Lyons will be back at work. He did what he had to do, and he went out there, and I, I think this rope saved his life. And I did check a police spokeswoman telling me Officer Lyons is out of the hospital. He is at home recovering. Local for you in Columbus, Dan Perlman, NBC4. Dan, thank you.